as BP officials scramble to contain the oil spill and save the Gulf coastline from further contamination, University of Florida researchers are working on a save of their own. Researchers are collecting cyanobacteria or blue-green algae from sensitive coral reefs just offshore in the Florida Keys. The reefs suffered extensive damage from the cold winter and now could face further damage from the oil that is spreading around the Gulf of Mexico. That's a cyanobacterium. UF researchers are working to collect as many different samples of the algae as possible because of recent findings that the algae may help cure diseases. These are organisms that overgrow corals and we and others have shown that they produce interesting compounds that have drug-like properties and may be exploited for biomedical purposes such as uh, anti-cancer drugs and, and others. Experts consider the ocean an untapped resource for drug discovery. Damage from the oil contamination could lead to the loss of potential cures for many diseases. All the marine biodiversity that is affected ultimately by that or can be affected by this oil spill and that endangers a number of species here in the Florida Keys and consequently the marine drug discovery efforts that are going on by our groups and other groups in this area of the United States. Currently, only two drugs are available that were developed for marine research with another 14 drugs that are in clinical trials. UF researchers hope to add to that number when they start testing their latest finds. At the University of Florida, I'm Chris Bilowich.